Hello my friends and welcome back to the Pencil YouTube channel where today we're going to be talking about a very exciting step forward in the world of AI video generation which is image to video <laughs> with Google VO3. Just before we dive on in, if the world of video generation is new to you, please do not fret. My good friend Tim has an excellent video on this already on the Pencil YouTube channel which you can find in the link down below or linked at the end of this video. So first things first on VO3, where do we find it? Well, on our pencil dashboard, over on the left-hand side, you can see work. If you hit that plus icon and go down to generate video, we'll go through to our video platform. On the left-hand side, the second icon down is models. If you hit that, and all the way down there at the bottom is VO3. Once we have that selected, we're gonna go back to the left-hand side. We're gonna hit that magic wand, and it's now our opportunity to upload or select our image. Here is a lovely little wedding scene that I created using pencil. Once your image is uploaded, you have the opportunity here to kind of resize and make sure it fits our canvas. But then after that, we're gonna head on down to prompt. Now when looking at prompt here at Pencil, we like to think we know what makes a fantastic prompt. What takes the image that's in your head and tries to bring it to life. Up on screen now, we wanna show you that formula. Something I like to call the six pillars of pencil. So let's break it down. First of all, we're looking at our medium. Are we generating a photo, a video? Is it a claymation, an animation? Looking at subject, what is it? Is it a dog? Is it a horse? Is it a bus? What are we talking about? A description, giving some depth and detail to take away that room for error from the AI. Framing and setup, are we indoor, outdoors, underwater? Lighting and color, is it a warm sunny day or is it a cold chilly night? Medium specific settings, that's lens, you know, are we looking at lenses? What kind of camera are we using? How far away are we? Are we looking at motion? And with VO3, we actually add a seventh pillar to the equation, and this is so exciting, and that's sound. For the very first time, we have sound effects, we have ambience, and we have dialogue to be able to play with, and that is so exciting. So, let's get into our first prompt. So we're gonna throw that prompt up on screen now, and we hope that with the way that we've laid it out, you can see that we've touched every single one of these seven pillars, our medium, subject, description. They're all being addressed to leave as little room for error as possible. Diving back in, we have an opportunity to add a negative prompt, which is anything that we want removed from our scene, anything we don't want to happen. But if you're happy and I'm happy, I want to see what the best man has to say. Let's hit generate. Now for full disclosure, I'm going to remove a little bit of waiting time here because you don't want to hear me waffle on forever. But now that we have our result, Let's see how it came out. Um, thank you all for coming, but it should be me sitting here. I love you, Louise. How cool is it seeing that come to life? Amazing. But I just want to show you one more example. Even though we have that amazing prompt in that first example, sometimes you can actually save yourself a little bit of legwork. Up on screen, I'm going to put another image that I've generated with pencil, and it's a lovely little claymation farmer on his tractor, on his farm. And if I asked you to guess what kind of sound this would have, you'd probably think, I'm going to hear the sounds of the farm, the birds chirping, I'm going to hear the tractor whirring, and you would be exactly right. I uploaded this image into pencil and VO3, and it used that information, you know, the logical conclusions, to give me exactly the sound that you're listening to now, and as you can imagine, spot on. And that, my friends, is the power of VO3 and Pencil, bringing your ideas to life. As always, we love to see what you create. Please reach out to the Pencil team with any questions. Thanks for watching and have a great day.